Good evening, good morning, good afternoon, depending from where you are on this planet. Gianluca Massi is speaking from uh, the Virtual Telescope Project. While the weather was uh, evilly cloudy earlier at the time, uh, the scheduled time for this live feed, now the weather is good and I decided to run, even if uh, at a very different time at this point, this live feed to show you this unique object. And as I don't know how, how long the, the, the sky will be clear, I want to start sharing with you images right away with you, my friends. Gianluca Massi speaking from Rome.
Here we are friends, I opened the microphone, Gianluca Mas is speaking from Rome, virtual telescope project. I'm sorry, yeah, I was muted earlier, but I was doing some check. You know, this event was scheduled for earlier today, but it was <clears throat> very, very cloudy in Rome in Italy and now it cleared that I decided to run this right away. We are tracking 2020 HESO, a space debris coming from the Surveyor 2 lunar mission in 1966 and I, right now we are just imaging, leaving this object free to move and how, as it moves in the sky you see it is also rotating. This is why you see it at every rotation brighter. This is in regular shape and at every rotation there is a moment uh, when it is reflecting us more light from the sun. This is why you have bright dots along its trail. This is a truly beautiful image, my friends. Now I want to do something different. I'm stopping here the imaging. And now I, I ask the telescope to track the object. We are doing something completely different now. Here we were tracking the, the, the Earth rotation, basically the stars, and the object was leaving a trail. Now I'm tracking the object and the stars should leave a trail. Let's see if this is the truth. Happy that I could give this live feed despite the weather was extremely bad at the beginning. And I hope you can appreciate this because as I told you, I was not sure I was going to sleep actually when my weather alarm just uh, told me that the sky was clear at the observatory. I'm happy that we could share this. It's so important to me. Every time we have something special to try bringing that thing to you live via the virtual telescope project. So Luca Masi is speaking from Rome. The telescope is about 100 kilometers far from me in the south. And we are just controlling this stuff remotely, thanks to the, the technology, you know. And here it is. I see you understand what is happening. Now the telescope is tracking the object, okay? This is why it is uh, showing as a bright dot of light while the stars are showing very long trails. <clears throat> Let's wait for a while to take more images. And uh, this object is um, safely coming uh, extremely close to us in uh, about six hours, more or less. It should be at uh, 50,000 kilometers from us, 13% of the lunar average distance from our planet. I repeat, really no risks for all. This is a simply very safe close approach by this man-made object. Very nice to me. Happy that the virtual telescope is bringing this to you, as I told you, in real time. I want to see if I can improve something here, just updating the data I'm using to track this stuff. All this is happening in real time, so I am taking decisions in this very moment. <clears throat> okay. I want to try to update the elements I'm using to track this fast stuff. Oh, 
okay I need to change a few things sorry Okay, meantime the system is up and running, you see. Okay, I should have the right data now. How beautiful is this? I love tracking this stuff in space. And let me try again to track this object. Let me see if I have it there. We should, we have, and now back to a longer exposure. And I really hope that even if with the, such a very quick uh, <laughs> approach, this very quick surprise after the beginning, I canceled the event because it was very cloudy. As soon as I saw clear sky, I decided to share with you this quick, this quick view from Italy. Now waiting for the next image and then I will go to sleep basically you can support the virtual telescope project if you want just visit our website at virtualtelescope.eu and from there you can support us by donations keeping us to stay alive in these very hard times by the way and we always bring the sky to you for free to everyone just waiting this uh, less than one minute left and i do expect to see the object as a, as a nice dot of light here with the long star trades. The image is coming and we will say goodbye to this with this image downloading right now from Howard system. Here we are, my friends. And with this, the Luca Massi from Rome Virtual Telescope Project is saying goodbye, everyone. Thank you for joining this uh, quick live feed, and I hope you had fun with us. Keep in mind and consider the opportunity to support the Virtual Telescope project by visiting our website at virtualtelescope.eu. That's all, friends. Stay safe and keep looking at the stars. <laughs>